Hey everybody, I'm here with another recommendation from Will Nettiger on his blog, Bewilderingly. So I've been working my way through the February 2022 Indie Puzzle Highlights. And this one is from Christopher Adams at his blog, Arctan X Words. I've never actually had to say it out loud, Arctan of X Words. Um, I've got a link to it in the description. Uh, so this is a blog I used to actually solve pretty regularly a few years ago, although I, I haven't kept up with it, so I haven't seen this puzzle before. Um, yeah, so this one is entitled, Hey, How About a Nice Hawaiian Punch? Again, from Christopher Adams. Okay, um, let's just dig in here. So ambulance staff for short, kind of guess EMTs. Org that gave former LifeLock CEO Todd Davis the ID number blank. Um, so nor normally the answer is SSN. That's a really common three-letter answer, especially at the ends of words, but I think this must be SSA since it's the organization, the Social Security Administration. Uh, Felix and Bruno to Mirabelle. I think that's Encanto, the Tios. Um, oof, that one is really hard to read. Um, oh, because it's a really long clue. Um, so kill the blank, because I sure ain't effing with it. Marry the Oreo, because I love Oreos. Yeah, that would work best. Frisco's response to an FMK situation Involving four-letter crossword use, which, uh, okay, um, yeah, I'll come back to that one. <laughs> um, all right, I blank, explain the state that I'm in. Oh, this album was a big part of my college life. Um, I can't explain the state that I'm in. Migraine accompanier company year at a time. Invite for coffee at your apartment after the date. Ask up, maybe? I'll pop, so ACAB. City in Illinois, Little Egypt region. Is it Cairo? I know in Kansas it's pronounced Cairo, but I don't know about the Illinois city. If he flew them, he was crazy and didn't have to, but if he didn't want to, he was blank and had to. So that's a Catch-22 quote. Emulate the singer of probably the only Mamskin song you can name. Um, Began, that's right. Um, Ghanaian, Ghanaian diplomat Kofi Annan. I think he was, was he Secretary General of the UN. Back from vacation, perhaps. Maybe unpacking. Transition fungal, maybe top surgery. Um, drink often consumed during the most exciting two minutes in sports. Um, oh, that is the Kentucky Derby, so mint julep. It is what it is. It's what it is. It's? <laughs> See, normally that would be breaking the rules. You can't use the answer in the clue, but I think that's what's going on here. And, um, yeah, something with crosswordies at TUI. Um, yeah. Portuguese year, ano, lit af, burnt. Uh, solution to a leak code problem, an algorithm, STP part. Um, actually, I actually don't know what STP, this is a really common crossword answer. It's some sort of fuel additive. Unless it's like T, it's part of STP or P. Verb often used in MTG, Magic the Gathering, um, Bat. Or maybe this is turned. Oh, tap, yeah, you tap cards in Magic. Okay, and it is P as an STP. Um, okay, settles up before getting settled, say. Um, California tribe whose last known member was known by the Yana word for man, since there's nobody to formally introduce him, as per tradition. Is that like Yuma? Maybe not. First in a trilogy that continues with down low and ends with too slow. So high five. Um, Auto-tune aficionado who won the first season of The Masked Singer. Don't know that one. Base set stolen in Phil Rizzuto's baseball commentary and Paradise by the Dashboard Light. Uh, 
not still in first, so probably third. Contents of many Monet stacks. Did he do haystacks, Monet? I know some people people. Uh, sure. Holds up the seven of diamonds. Is this your card? Florida man. Juan Pon... Uh, Ponce de Leon? But Juan... Was Ponce de Leon... Was that a last name and his first name was Juan? <laughs> and did he discover St. Augustine? I actually have no idea. Um, makes fun of with on. Maybe like rags on. San Diego State University. The more in Oliver's twist for request, please sir, so let's gruel. So it must be rags. Plant used to make mezcal, agave. City that's part of India's Golden Triangle, Agra. Good crossword word to know. It's where the um, Taj Mahal is. Part of the Cedar River, presumably, given the name of the Iowa City. That's not Iowa City, that it flows through. Um, not sure. Hey, how about a nice... Oh, sorry. Nickname for a group of people that I've muted and or blocked on Twitter because they won't shut up about the spelling bee. Hive, I assume. Um, power sources for some vibes. Oh. Rapids. Cedar Rapids. Okay, I'm good. At it. And I'm also seeing this uh, on PAC, on, like, what is this? Does this unscramble to something? More, pop more popular than Ponchier. Um, unpack, Kepin? Okay. Oh, let's see. Uh, emulating a pigeon, perhaps. Cooing. Seeps like a like honey out of a blank. Oozes. Rosie, notably, who cheated her way to victory in the Boston Marathon. Not sure. Take a knee. Georgia, etc. For once. No, once for short. Uh. Is that like a Soviet Republic? And I did that wrong, okay. Oh yeah, SSRs. They're often used for funny IPA names. Puns, I guess. Bothers to no end, irks. I guess Ruiz, Rosie Ruiz. iPhones, kick the bucket, hop the twig, bit the dust, snuffed it, or breathed one's last, died. Perfect places, Edens. Makes flush, evens up, maybe? Compete for, buy. Long ass dashes that separate parts of sentences like this. I think that's an M dash and, and an N dash is shorter. Um, promising, in a way. Semi-domed recesses, apses. Still don't know how to pronounce that. I should look that up. Group headquartered in a country, Austria, that's not one of its members. Probably OPEC. I know, that, yeah, I didn't do that one. Okay, settles up before getting settled. Say. This might not be A. No, okay, okay. Given the theme, this has to be those letters. That's not high five down the, is it like up, up something, up top, six letters though, up high, down low, autotune, fish, you know, is T-Pain maybe, prepays, okay, so it was hey, hey. Up and coming. Okay. Yeah, had a one mistake there, two mistakes. Okay. Take for oneself. This is double A's. And it's head something. Direction that takes you uptown in New York City. 
Um, yeah, it's not actually north south. It's like uh, north northeast maybe. Oh, head cannon. So that's like stuff that's not officially part of a TV show or a movie, but you imagine as being what's going on. So it's your own take. Massachusetts City, home to the Boston Marathon's Heartbreak Kill. I'm going to guess Natick, just because it's so popular in crosswords. Pretty good. Larry Walters has a flying blank chair and a BB gun. Maybe it's not Natick. <laughs> uh, I was thinking that would be like attention or something. Um, descriptor for a very small hotel room, such as those in Enemies to Lovers fan fiction, where two people have to share a room, and that's what causes them to get together. Very small hotel room. Clear as a cribbage board, probably unpeg. School whose math department includes Terrence, Terrence Tao, one of the great mathematicians, but I do not know. Lisa of Geico commercials and also nice stories. Lisa Loeb, is it UCLA maybe? Former uh, women's national team star Abby Wambach, soccer player. Noob is a insult. Uh, plebe slipped past carefully. Um, could it be yield by? Uh, cold heart. Eat the rich. Ship that killed Jason amusingly. Is that the Argo? Label that doesn't yet apply to any member of Gen Alpha. T. Look angrily at glare. Um, venti at Starbucks, functionally speaking, the large. Lawn chair, so Newton. Uh, this might not be eel. Come back to that. Connor Ober, still in bright eyes. Was bright eyes, I guess. City whose minor league teams include the Seawolves and the Otters. Erie, maybe? Hospital safety gear, briefly. Not sure. Little fluffy lap dogs for short. Palms. This might not be right. I forget what that term was. Um, okay, this is eased by single occupancy taste sense with glutamates umami word that Carl Anthony Town said was the actual answer when he got accused of cheating at Wordle oh, oh, no. Rodriguez Lopez of at the drive-in and the Mars Volta Omar is the only name that I can think would fit there um, I literally just told you host Jimmy. If you haven't watched it, it's the funniest thing. There's a YouTube link here to watch. Brothers that directed The Ballad of Buster Struts. That was the Coen brothers. James Bond film. I think that's Eon with an E, I think. Numerical system in which ABBA is the equivalent to 1906 and base 10. Um, D -d 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 um, du dual decimal? Du something decimal. Reference work that's been online since 2000. I'm guessing that's the OED. 2021 documentary starring Tim Curry that was subtitled The Story of It. Pennywise, probably. Edna, German article, Das. Okay. IQ character... Hajime, affectionately? Nope. X, Y, and Z for three. Are those axes? This is Arctan X words. Word rhyme with face and also Oz in the Hercules song Zero to Hero. Probably vase and Vaz. The robot in Get the Effing Robot, Shinji memes for short. Okay, ales maybe brown, blonde, or ginger. Descriptor of 69 across, cold hard, I guess, and a hint to the rest of the circle letters in this puzzle's theme entries.
Um, So the C was already used over here. So a P and a U. Un app. Now personal protective something. Wait. Peanut mix? What? <laughs> okay. I literally just told you host Jimmy. Jimmy Carr? And Omar, pause. Eerie. Personal protect. Ava, is that a name? Oh, you have successfully completed this puzzle. Okay. What am I doing? What am I not understanding? I just PNAU remix? This is a music thing that I just don't understand. <laughs> All right, let's let's take a look at um, Will Nettiger's notes here. I love a two-part theme, and this is a great one, inspired by the Elton John Dua Lipa song "Cold Heart" slash PNAU remix. Okay, I'm just not up on pop culture at all. I've heard the song, I guess, on the radio once or twice. Um, didn't know it was Dua Lipa, I knew it was Elton John. It's got theme entries that have a C in the exact center. Is that correct? It does. C in the, so a cold heart. So a C in the center. That's interesting. Um, and have an anagram of PNAU hidden in them. Okay. It's a 19 by 15 grid, which is why this video is a little bit longer than normal. Yeah. Plenty of good stuff here. Yeah. Manjula, top surgery, head cannon. All right. Um, yeah. So this is an interesting theme. Um, <laughs> I was still able to solve it, even though um, the pop culture reference was mostly lost on me. I mean, it, yeah, you, I got the idea that these letters were involved. I didn't notice that C was in the center, but I, it does make sense now, seeing that C was detached from the other four. Um, yeah. Um, now knowing that, that's a yeah. Like like Will said, it's a it's a cool double theme kind of going on. You know, two different parts in each themer, which is pretty impressive. You know, unpacking Ponchier, Juan Ponce de Leon, up and coming single occupancy. So finding all of these words, um, pretty impressive. And it's a symmetric you know rotational symmetry, nineteen by fifteen. Cool. Um, all right. Well, um, I'll probably jump and do another orca award winner next but i'm gonna there's a few more february 2022 ones i'm gonna look at um if you enjoyed this video check out some other ones consider subscribing i try to post these every morning all right thank you for watching